Hey everyone, and welcome back to another video. In today's episode, I'm going to show you how you can get Discord on Windows 6P and as of this year. So it's actually really simple. All you need is a, br a certain browser and obviously an account. So the browser you I use is called Superium, and it was designed by um, a guy on GitHub by the name of Win32 Subsystem. So, as you can tell from the title, it's a Chromium fork for Windows XP 2003 and up. So, Vista 7 and 8.x, 8.0.1. In our case, it's Windows XP Professional Service Pack 3. So, let's go ahead and down here. Now, yeah, as you can tell, it just says it's an about. Um, if you scroll down, this is the latest release. The following changes, so a lot of stuff. So, for us, because we only have four gigabytes of memory, we're gonna have to use Vimium 32 bit, uh, which I already have. So let's go ahead and close that. As you can tell, it's right here, and as you can tell, it launches immediately, which is really nice. It, it's really nice. It launches immediately. So let's go ahead and go to about Vimium. As you can tell, it's version 122.0.6261.85, which is an official build, 32-bit version. And as you can tell, that says down here, the beer is made possible by Chrome open source projects and open source software, such as extensions and other stuffs. So yeah, that is actually nice, which is pretty cool. Um... So... Um, now, you can get Discord on here, which is, okay, so let's go back to Supreme Memo Card. Discord does work. Sorry about that, I'll have to move it out. Just gotta purchase some stuff real quick here. But, it does work. Which is really nice. So as you can tell. Um, let me scroll down so I would not accidentally do anything stupid here. So, yeah. Oh, what was that? Okay, so the input. Now, voice chats work as well. <laughs> as you can tell. Excuse me, I'm sneeze. We have input, which is really nice. Honestly, I like that, and that's a good thing. Um, and this is, in fact, fully functional in Discord. Like, you can chat here, you can send images, you can voice chat. Screen sharing does work, but it's going to be really laggy for this particular system because it's only got 4 gigabytes of memory, which by no means is enough for Discord. I mean, it's kind of dumb that Discord purged their 32-bit version of the system, of the app, sorry, back in 2023, December of that year. Um, I don't like that. Um, because it means, like, you, if you're running a 32-bit version of any operating system, 7, 8, 10, XP, even, hell, anything... Um, it's not gonna end well for you because of how picky it is. But because of this browser, Superium, it's actually available like it's on the GitHub page. It's available for every single older browser. Um, and you can actually get a lot of stuff, like for a lot of systems. Now, it's to show you that I'm actually not using just any random mod of Windows. Because this could be, might as well be a skin pack. Is you have Windows XP, and as you can tell, it's completely genuine. It's a genuine copy. So yeah, um, yeah. I suppose that is all I really need to show you at this point. So yeah, two things. Um, real quick here, two things. Two things that you would need if you ever want to try this. One. Supreme Browser itself. 
I'll leave the link in the description if anybody wants it. And two, you need a Discord account. That's the only two things you need out of this for this to work. And that is all. I'll see you all in the next video. Don't forget to like, um, comment, subscribe. Also, when you're going to be commenting, just give me ideas for what else I should make a video about. Please do. Much appreciated. Thank you. See you all soon.